up, guys? MMA Game here, bringing you another video. This is a live commentary, me using Brian T City Ortega in ranked, going up against Chad Money Mendez. If you guys enjoyed the live commentaries, make sure to leave a like on the video. I want to thank you guys for all the support. And we are going to be trying to get loose with Ortega. I've been using Ortega, so I'm going to try to show you some, some new things that I learned. I'm going to try to use his boxing a little bit just to start. Not get too carried away with uh, with Mendez. The little short, compact punches. Especially those uppercuts. So I'm not going to really mess with them too much. But I'm going to try to make him miss a little bit. He's already getting some good damage to our head. So... We just want to move around a little bit. Going for the clinch right here. Trying to get a knee. Going in for the tie clinch. Can we get a trip takedown? No. But we do manage to land a knee to the body. Little combo into the clinch. And then I'll try to fake out that. Go to the tie. Didn't work. Back to the tie clinch. He lands a knee, but we block it. Can we get the single leg? And there we go. We managed to get the single leg takedown. Working the clinch. I've been practicing the clinch a little bit more. Working on certain denies and stuff like that. Messing around with using the clinch to get people down. Because sometimes takedowns, it just doesn't it doesn't work. So we're going to try to actually finish him right here with T-City on the ground. See if we're able to. Even though Chad Mendez has really good ground stats. But he's able to get back to his feet. Uh, we're going to keep some boxing going. But he knocks us down right there. We get a little bit too carried away with the boxing. Timing that jab pretty nicely. And we knock him down. Oh, I didn't even know he had a Superman punch. I didn't even mean to throw that. And he drops us again. And again he drops us. So we've been dropped multiple times now. So we definitely have to switch gears. As we get that beautiful reversal right there with T-City. Can we make our way into mount and try to get that mounted triangle? Here we go. Going for it right here. T-City. Oh, he manages to get out. He's going to roll us over into... Guard, so here's where we're gonna try to go to rubber guard. But he we do not get it. Trying to catch the punches, but it's not working. So we're just gonna pull him down and end that round right there. So we definitely lost that round. We got dropped multiple times. But we're still in it to win it. And uh we will not be giving up in this fight at all with T City. I've had some big comebacks with him so we're gonna definitely try to continue to work the striking as well as the ground game with T-City as I'm trying to throw this crazy combination jab straight and then lead head kick oh and he somehow goes underneath my kick right there. That was crazy. Ducks down. Oh, beautiful lead uppercut. Timed perfectly. And T-City gets him down. We get him. We get him down. We get him in the rear naked. Here we go. This is what we want with T-City. Oh, but he's able to escape. But now we're in guard. Go to rubber guard. Trying to deny that, but we don't get the deny. We get the we get the strike catch though. But we're not able to actually flip him over. He he gets up before we can transition. Able to get back to our feet right here. I, you know, we got to use the time we got. That lead uppercut is going to be money, I think. 
It worked for us before, so we're gonna try to go back to it. Whew, there we go. I could have got the guillotine submission catch on that takedown, but... Oh, can I get it right here? Seeing if he's gonna go for the... Takedown. Ooh, he get that combo on him. He gets a nice little ducking uppercut, but he doesn't have as much stamina. Ooh, just missed that head kick. I'm looking for that lead uppercut all day. And we go for the overhand, but we're way too far away. So a good round for Ortega. Definitely a good round for us. You know, there's that lead uppercut. That was just a picture-perfect counter right there. Boom, he ducks right into it. And so we're going to be looking to find that uppercut again. He survived the TKO. But we're going to see if we can get him out of there in round number three. Brian Ortega, live commentary. If you guys are enjoying this video, make sure to hit that like button. Going to try to go out with a... Try to start with a running strike, but we miss, and he lands an uppercut. too carried away with the striking jab uppercut Woo! oh there it is again just like we thought and it's all over Brian T. City Ortega gets it done I wasn't able to show too many of his you know submissions or anything in that fight guys but we were able to find uh, different patterns with what strikes were landing and, you know, what my opponent kept doing. He kept going forward. That lead uppercut was there all day long, so we're able to find it again, and it lands the exact same way as it did in the other round. I mean, he goes down in the same exact way, but this time, you know, it's one too many shots to the chin, and we're able to get him out of there with the TKO. Thank you guys for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to head kick that bell button, head kick that like button, and spinning wheel kick the comment section with who you want to see me use in the next video follow me on twitch tv and twitter till next time this has been a big game peace